Freeport man is recovering tonight after he says he was beaten over the weekend for wearing an Obama t-shirt. KSLA News 12's Tanya Francois has the details. They were screaming, F Obama, F Obama, and, you know, that, well, something about a president. And, you know, basically, uh, you know, I was hit. Kalen Johnson will still need surgery to fix his fractured eye socket and broken nose, which he says came after a beating Saturday night while he was at a Sitco gas station on Industrial Drive right off of I-20. Seemed like some rednecks, just, they're pretty big guys, big, and they were blasting music or whatever. And I mean, by the time I turned around and looked at them, they, they were on me. This is beautiful. This is Johnson at the Obama party on election night. He says he was heavily involved in the campaign. The 32-year-old has even opened a store where he sells Obama t-shirts. Things go on every day and all this does is just that it, it shows that we, do ha we did have purpose throughout the campaign and we still have work to do after the campaign. Johnson says his wallet was also stolen during the attack and is still waiting on Treeport police to make a formal statement. Police tell us once the case is assigned to a detective, they will investigate. In Treeport, Tanya Francois, KSLA News 12. Just in time for the holidays, there's a new way for scammers to get your banking information. And they're using something many of us have. We're talking about your cell phone. 